All right, guys, so today is the day. I got her enclosure all set up right here. Let's go get her. All right, here she is. Ready to take her to her new home. All right, guys, here we go. The first super dwarf reticulated python for coiled retics. I cannot wait. I've been waiting years, literally years for these animals to be in a position where I can start my business and really get the investment animals that I want was really important to me. And uh, now we're in a position to, to do that and really take things to the next level. So um, let's get into this. So first and foremost, great packaging job. I wanna give a shout out to Lucas Bagnera over at Lab Exotics in Dallas, Texas. He's just done a great job uh, teaching me a little bit along the way. When it comes to the localities, just some of the different details in keeping these animals. He knows so much. And uh, so Lucas, thanks again for, for everything. Uh, he's a good friend of mine. So this is a female. So she's going to be a breeder for us here at Coiled. Really, really excited. I have eight enclosures set up. So this is going to be the first of eight snakes that I'm going to be getting over the next few months and putting our, our breeding stock together. So I'm really, really excited, focused on females. Want to make sure that I get enough females and raise them, raise them right. So Lucas did a great packaging job. So she is um, a pure Kalatoa. Her parents were wild caught from Kalatoa. And this is his, I think his first Kalatoa clutch. So really, really excited to dive into this. And oh man, she looks beautiful. Holy cow. Wow. Now this room is a little bit cool, so I just wanna, I don't wanna freak her out at all. But wow, she looks absolutely amazing. I'm shaking, I'm so excited. Wow. I don't know if the camera can pick her up at all, but she's got these really awesome colors to her. The Travis Kubis Kalatoas are infamous here in the States and they kind of have these really silvery gravelly looks when it comes to their coloration. And she is just beautiful when it comes to the saturation of some of the oranges and some of the different things here. So I'm gonna see if she comes out. I don't wanna force anything. Just wanna let her come out on her own a little bit. Get used to her new surroundings. Now she's out. Look at this snake. Look at that snake, man. It doesn't get, it doesn't get any better than that. Look at that. Pure Kalatoa. I'm gonna be able to hopefully make some pure Kalatoas. I'd love to make pure Kalatoas, but I'm also going to use her in some of my morph projects. Really increase the percentages and push the industry forward. So I'm just really, really excited. She's got this awesome tail pattern, if you pick that up at all. And uh, my kids are super excited, so I'm gonna let them come in. Come on in, boys. Are you here? Come on in. Whoa. Come over here. Come over here. Whoa, look at, look at her. Oh, look. Yeah, she's awesome, isn't she? All right, here she is. Our pure Kalatoa F1. This is a fresh bloodline. And as I was saying earlier, the Travis Kubis bloodline is infamous here in the US. And Lucas did a great job with this breeding and it's once again a fresh bloodline that we can we can use to push the industry forward for our morph projects and here at coiled we're just really excited to have this girl in our collection and uh she's just she's just amazing super curious 
very relaxed and uh, we're just really excited to to have her here in her new home and um, go on girl I just love her tail pattern here I don't know if the camera's picking that up I just love her tail pattern just thick bold lot black lines here and just a, a stunning animal all right guys so that wraps up our first of many unboxing videos that we're going to be doing here at coiled over the next few few months so make sure to like this video subscribe so that you guys can tune in we have some big plans here and really excited for what the future holds have a great day